Let's pick it. Need. Actually, no. Don't know what color to make it. Oh, that's good. Can't be a work. I really like um like beige colors for the interiors. I don't know why I always have them. Let's get that for the style. Oh, she's nice. You can do the mission. Oh, why are you texting me? Missions. Thought we already were. Oh, not like this. You've been personally selected for a spot on a game show here in town. Game show? You're not trying to auction me off on some dating thing, are you? Trust me, you'll love this shit. Meet me and I'll show you. <sighs> you better be right. Hey, yeah, Genki Bowl. Ah! Steelport, and welcome to Professor Genki's super ethical reality climax. Time to see how the game is played. Fight your way through Professor Genki's super sparkle lap for fun and profit. Now, with every man, woman, and tiger shot, your prize money goes up. Yeah, so I'll probably end it off after this. I'm pretty sure I've gotten enough. Okay. Did I finish my tea? Yeah, I did, unfortunately. Okay. Welcome to so, Professor Genki's Lego. Super Ethical Reality Climax. Murder time is fun time, right, Bobby? You got it, Zach. If our contestants can survive the deadly traps, Ow. armed mascots, and those freakishly huge hunters, they can win a hefty pile of cash. This game looks deadly, because it is. <laughs> but it's still probably safer than driving in Steelport. <laughs> Our competitor isn't from Steelport this time, Zach. Today, we'll be watching the leader of the Saints, the world-famous Stillwater Street Gang. As many times as this former gangbanger has been shot at, blown up, run over, and generally put through hell, this competition probably seems pretty routine. Um, routine maybe, but lucrative. You aren't going to make Professor Genki-sized dollars driving hoes around, that's for sure. <laughs> Cha-ching! Come on, just heal. Oh yeah, shit, I can't heal. Apparently our contestant is quite the hero back in Stillwater. Have you ever been to Stillwater, Bobby? I did, and it wasn't a good trip. My car got covered in sewage by a passing <laughs> Yeah, I kinda forgot. <laughs> Welcome to Professor Genki's super ethical reality climax. Murder time is fun time, right, Bobby? 
You got it, Zach. If our contestants can survive the deadly traps, armed mascots, and those freakishly huge hunters, they can win a hefty pile of cash. This game looks deadly, because it is. <laughs> but it's still probably safer than driving in Steelport. <laughs> our competitor isn't from Steelport Ooh. this time, Zach. Today, we'll be watching the leader of the Saints, the world-famous Stillwater Street Gang. As many times as this former gangbanger has been shot at, God, how am I doing so bad? Am I able to get a health upgrade yet? I can't even access Welcome it. Welcome to Professor Genki's super ethical reality climax. Murder time is fun time, right Bobby? You got it, Zach. If our contestants can survive the deadly traps, armed mascots, and those freakishly huge hunters, they can win a hefty pile of cash. This game looks deadly, because it is. <laughs> but it's still probably safer than driving in Steelport. <laughs> our competitor isn't from Steelport this time, Zach. Today, we'll be watching the leader of the Saints, the world-famous Stillwater Street Gang. As many times as this former gangbanger has been shot at, blown up, run over, and generally put through hell, this competition probably seems pretty routine. Um, routine maybe, but lucrative. You are going to make Professor genki sized dollars driving hoes around, that's for sure. <laughs> Cha-ching! We need more veteran gunslingers in this arena. Apparently, our contestant is quite the hero back in Stillwater. Have you ever been to Stillwater, Bobby? I did, and it wasn't a good trip. My car got covered in sewage by a passing septic truck. <laughs> really? What did you do to piss off the driver? I didn't do a damn thing. I just wish I hadn't rented a convertible. Wait, you were in the car when this happened? Back to the action. Our contestant is doing really well. Another great burst of action by the contestant. Come on. I'm actually really, I actually really don't want to die. No, I need the help. God damn it. Everything right. We don't see a contestant dominate an arena like this often. So, Bobby, how do you clean sewage out of a convertible? With a toothbrush. Really? No, I let the rental company take care of it. Are you kidding me? Oh, wasn't that kind of shitty of you? Not as shitty as what this contestant is doing to those mascots. And that's it! We have a winner! So that's as much money as you can get. Apparently. Because I'm pretty sure I killed everyone in that. Okay guys, so now that I've completed that, I think I'm going to end it off here. If you enjoyed this series, uh, leave it a like to tell me that, I want, that you want to continue it. Well, that you want me to continue it, sorry. I'm not good at these endings, actually. And yeah, like, comment, subscribe if you want to see more. Remember in that first episode, to well, if you go back to the first episode and comment happy birthday, Marianne, it'll be incredible. And I'll show my great-grandmother who's turning i think 84 or 86 one or the other and it'll be incredible she'll have such a big smile on her face and i'll thank all of you guys with vlogs if you guys either do that or get me to 150 subscribers by may 24th i will be uh posting vlogs and i'll show you guys my face <laughs> i'm nothing what you guys think i look like so i'll talk to you guys later